It's a wrong idea because it'll, it'll cause a lot of um, a lot of tension around the area and um, it won't be a good thing. It's one of the most controversial policing methods, but now a top black police officer has called for more young people to be stopped and searched for weapons, despite the fact many people believe it discriminates against black people. Keith Jarrett, the leader of the National Black Police Association, claims stop and search should be used more to tackle the rise in gun crime. He says black people want to see it happen. Everyone has to be looked at in the same respect. They can't say because you're black, you're more likely to commit crime because it's all about the thoughts of people, the mind frame. It's not really the, the colour. Only this weekend, a 13-year-old boy was shot on this street. He said to be in a stable condition. That's the kind of crime Mr Jarrett wants to tackle with stop and searches. But black people are six times more likely to be stopped than white people. You're six times yeah. more likely to be stopped than I am. Yeah. That's not right, is it? No, no, it's not right. Because I'm a black person, you're, you're a Caucasian person. It doesn't, it's, it's not right. It's totally against my human rights. Stop and search everyone, then it's fair and just. Stop and search just the young, black and ethnic minorities. We know what it did in the 80s and we do not need that now in the 21st century. This needs to be an integrated policy of policing that really starts first and foremost with prevention. People of whatever ethnicity, whatever background, if there are grounds to search those people, then it shouldn't matter where they're from or what colour or what nationality they're from. If there are grounds to search people or if intelligence leads us to believe that somebody may have a knife or a gun on them, then we shouldn't feel restrained in searching them. Mr Jarrett claims stop and search is an effective way of disrupting gangs and reducing violence, but it also risks increasing racial tension. This is a sensitive issue, but a solution is needed to what is becoming a very serious problem. David Henry, Channel M News.